Hey guys, it's amazing. Welcome back to another video. Um, you know, in my other video, when my sheen haul, I said that I did a little bit of retail therapy. Here are the rest of the goods. Um, yeah, let, I'm gonna have to get up and show you the bags because I went a bit, I went a bit animal. Here we have a really pretty um, order from Miss Cap. Really cute, pretty little, pretty little thing one. We also went to Nasty Girl. Apparently, I just needed to um, buy all of this stuff, even though I physically can't go anywhere. This haul is a loungewear haul, as it says in the title of this video. I don't really have that many loungewear sets. I have like one, which I got for Christmas, which is really cute actually, and it's on my Instagram if you want to go check that photo out. I've got. Um, quite a lot of joggers though, like, I mean, outdated with joggers, I just love a good jogger! But that's probably because I work at JD, it's a bit of me, it's a bit of me. So I thought I'd buy some really cute loungewear sets and obviously show you guys. I did buy like three coats and like two blazers, which was a bit unnecessary, but I liked them so I brought them. So I will also show you them in this, in this little haul, just because, you know, we can go for daily walks to do our exercise and therefore it comes into the lockdown fit so i thought it through galleys i thought it through and i did get like another going out dress and i think like a couple of tops but other than that it is all loungewear obviously i will be trying them all on for you in this beautiful video because why wouldn't i I suppose if you want to see what i've got in the in the massive orders we should get in to the video i'm gonna start at miss pat first oh oh why have i done this to myself what's this see it's like a cute little unboxing with me as well this is such a cute video these are some joggers they're very thin just plain white joggers cuffed at the bottom elastic waist they I'm not sure whether they're going to be see-through or not. I don't know. Well, we'll we'll soon see when when I try them on for you. I think they're quite nice because I've not got white joggers and white joggers can go with quite literally anything, like literally anything. So I think that is always good. Plus they're thin, so I can still get away wearing them in summer, which I'm very happy about. These white joggers are very thin and very see-through. I've got a bodysuit on and I know it's black, but you can see my white pants and the bodysuit. And it's just like really big at the back. I don't know, they're like a nice fit on leg. Like they've got nice cuff bottoms, it's a nice fit. They're really thin, which I like, but I just, they are just a little bit, a little bit see-through. So um, they might go back, but I don't know. This dress does not look good. This doesn't look, this doesn't look like it looked on the website right now. Um, I like the colour of it, it's sort of asymmetric, it's got a little bow thing round, it's on just the one arm, maybe it will look better on, let's hope it looks better on, it was a bargain anyway, it was like £40 down to 4 so um, I just threw it in just because it looked quite nice and it was cheap, so maybe, let's, let's hope it looks better on, the dress doesn't fit, if I can't go any lower with the camera on this dress because my entire bottom area is practically out. It's that short. Um, it also physically does not do up. This is a size 8. I am a size 6 to 8. Um, so all in all, don't buy this dress. Um, it comes up about 78 sizes too small and doesn't fit. Um, also, just the look of it, I just don't, don't, don't really like the actual dress itself. Now it's sort of half on my body. No, not for, really ain't for me. This beautiful, beautiful like play suit romper. Look how cute that is. It obviously it's short, it's got a little tie around the front. It's got mesh puffy sleeves. It's baby blue, baby blue, me wearing baby blue. That's a bit daring, isn't it? But I feel like in summer it will look quite cute and it was only a few quid, so I threw that one in. I think this is so cute. Little romper. Makes your bum look quite good. I like the sleeves. They're nice and puffy at the top, but tight at the bottom. You've got this cute little detailing. I actually really like it. Things are falling absolutely everywhere. We've got a coat, we've got a coat. 
I think this is gorgeous. Oh, which way is it? It's got a hood. I didn't even know it had a hood. Wow. I feel proud of that purchase. It's just like a camel tan coat. It's got... Has it got... Yeah, it does actually. It has pockets. It's got a little belt on. I think it's quite cute. It looks quite nice. I'm going to throw that there just so we don't mess that up. This coat is stunning. I love the way that it folds here. I love the fact that it's got a hood. The length is quite nice. It's not too long, not too short. The belt that comes with it to cinch it in. So it's like... It's just like a really pretty, you could put over anything, go anywhere with it. It just makes an outfit look a bit more bougie and put together. <gasps> this is my cardigan. This is my cardigan. I've been wanting like a maxi cardigan for the longest time, but I've never been able to find the perfect one. And I found the perfect one. It's got the cute little buttons. It's got a nice V-neck going on look. Cute V-neck. It's knitted. It's, I'm, I'd say it's more white than cream. But I think this will look really nice for me. It's quite thick as well, which is good because I don't want a cardigan that's like thin if I wanted a knit one. You get me? It is really long if you can't really tell. I've just put some Primark shorts on just so you can get the vibe of the cardigan. It's quite long. It's quite thick but sort of thin at the same time. And I quite like the arms. It's just really nice, like a little cute loungewear one. I, I like it. I got a grey sweater just because I wanted some new sweaters. So I brought some. It says on, what's it say on the front? In Visionary International Resort Couture. It's just oversized. It, what is it? Oh, it's sort of fleeced on the inside. That's what we like to see. I feel like this would look quite nice with a shirt underneath it. Or literally just to lounge around the house. I'm not too sure what I want to do with that one yet. Here's the grey one. I quite like the print. I think it's quite cute. It's quite literally exactly the same, but just a little bit less fluffy. It hangs a little bit longer. It's a little bit more baggier, but I quite like it. I feel like I just sort of lounge around the house in this one more than go out. Like, like the other one I'd go out in, the brown one I'd go out in more. This one, I feel like I just lounge around the house, but it's a really nice fit, so I do recommend. I know for this one though, I'm wearing this out. It's beautiful. It's brown. More, well, I wouldn't say brown, it's more taupe, and then the stitching is brown. And it says Beverly Hills Beach, Los Angeles Beach Club, 1993. Like, how beautiful. It's really thick as well, and it's fleece inside. And I just think it's absolutely beautiful. Like, with, un, with a shirt underneath it, with some black jeans and some, like, heels or Converse. I think this will be my new favourite jumper. So, here's this jumper. I actually quite like how dark the colour is I've put a little polar neck underneath just because I think it looks quite cute it's actually the sleeves aren't that bad like they're quite a nice length look how fleecy it is inside that that's what we like to see it's warm I think the embroidery on it is cute it's a nice length it's oversized but not like too big I really like it. I think this is one of my favourites out of everything I've brought to be honest with you. I've got a lovely little set so here are the cycling shorts, they're quite cute, it's like a grey, like a beigey whitish grey, comes with a matching cardigan and I like it because it's really thin and it's quite long so it goes over your bum and with like a cute little white crop top that would look quite nice and to be honest I would probably wear this out of the house, like if I was going like to the park or for a picnic or summer I would probably wear this in summer just because it's it's it is quite gorgeous and it's thin so you can get away with it cardigan is quite nice it's a lovely length just like just below the bum it's thin it's nice bicycling shorts on the other hand they are so see-through i think that it's a little bit of a joke why would anyone make material like that you you can you can you can literally see my pants through it that's I want to keep the cardigan because I can't wear these shorts, you see everything, but I don't want to get rid of them because they come as a set, so I can't send one back without the other. So I, either I keep them and just make sure I wear a lot, I don't know what I'm going to do. They're going to have to go back, that can't, no I can't, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't be wearing them surely. Let's move on to Nasty Girl. This is the first time I've ever shot from Nasty Girl and Miss Pap as well. 
So it's quite quite nice to try out new shops. Especially when their offers were so good. Obviously, I got everything in the sale. I do love myself a good sale. What's this? Oh, this is that beautiful top I ordered. A shoulder padded top. Just because I love a good shoulder padding. It's actually gorgeous. I just love it. Shoulder pads. It's tight at the bottom. What more would you love in a top? Like with some jeans, that would look quite nice. But you could dress it up and make it casual. Which I do like in an outfit. I do like that in a top where you can do a bit of both of it. Versatile. I like how fitted this top is at the bottom. I'm loving... Where's my shoulder pad gone on this arm? My shoulder pads aren't really sitting on my shoulders right now, are they? That's because I've got to fold them out myself. Got the effort. I think the shoulder pads look quite cute. Only thing is... I didn't know that there was a whole massive gap. It's fine. It's just one of them tops you're going to have to go topless with or wear like a tape bra or something like that. I'll have to find a different bra to wear because I can't go bloody braless. It's me. Um, I quite like it though. I think it looks quite cute, especially with these leather pants. I think it's quite a nice outfit. I got another cardigan because I wanted a cropped one, a cute little cropped one, and I couldn't just not buy this because I fell in love with it. You know when you see something and you fall in love with it? That was me with this item. Look how beautiful it is. It's like, it's called blush pink, but it's, it's definitely not blush pink. It's sort of like a beige, I'd say. More like a, a nudie beige. It's got some nice little buttons. It's got a nice little design. It's really thick, and I just love a bit of knitwear. I do love a little bit of knitwear. This cardigan is actually gorgeous. It's so thick and chunky. The buttons are beautiful. It's a beautiful fit. To be fair, it looks quite nice with this outfit. I'd probably wear this out of the house, you know, to go to the shop or something. I'm not gonna lie with some air forces or something. Or if I'm gonna go like round my mates to chill or if I'm gonna go to the cinema. This is something I'd throw on to go there. I'm in love with this. This, this entire thing is me. This cardigan is absolutely stunning. Oh, even the pattern, even, oh, I love it. I'm in love, I'm in love. On to another set. So this is the top. It's quite cute, I quite like it. It's, most of the things I got are knitted just because I love knitwear so much. It's got little buttons going down the middle of it. It's quite, it's just quite nice, isn't it? Quite nice to lounge in. And then here are the bottoms. They are wide leg. I do love a good wide leg. And they just, they are quite heavy actually, they're, they're quite thick, which I'm a bit about, but I think it'll be fine. I think, they will, I think they'll look quite nice on. This is quite nice. They're a little bit see-through, but it's, it's not really that noticeable. So just make sure you wear white pants, girls, when you wear them. They are not as baggy as the last pair, as the brown pair, but they are still quite baggy. Um, I would probably take the elastic in a little bit on these ones as well. But these ones are like floor length. These ones are a nicer length than the other ones. But it's literally the same trouser, really. I like the top. It, you can sort of see a bra for it, but it's not that big of a deal. You can see a bra in most tops nowadays. That's just how society is, I guess. It's a thumbs up for me. Not my fave, but I do quite like it. I've got this cute set. It's another shoulder padded crop top, which is nice. It's like a nice shade of nudie brown i really just don't really like the chocolate brown it's just not a bit of me but i do like the nudes and then the matching trousers again wide leg it's all i really like wide legs or flares i'm not not the biggest fan of skinny stuff beautiful i just think it's gonna look quite it does feel quite heavy i just hope they're not too long on me because i'm only five five i'm a quite a short girl um I did get everything in size small as well because I'm a size 6 to 8. So I just do hope that they're not too long. If not, it's fine. Just roll the waist over. Lovely jubbly. I'm in love. I'm actually in love with this fit. The top, so nicely fitted. The shoulder pads really, really are going the extra mile. I think I'm going to be investing in some shoulder padded tops. They are gorgeous. The wide leg, beautiful. Absolutely what we love to see. None of it see-through. It's all a lovely shade of brown. It's comfy as anything, and that's what we like to see. So this is getting a massive thumbs up from me. I would definitely recommend you buy it. Next I've got the most beautiful three piece set I think I've ever seen. Again, it's nudie brown. This is the top, cute little buttons going down it. Oh, beautiful, what's not to like? It's got 
lovely waistband which is ties up and cuffed ankles i'm a lover for a cuffed ankle and to top it off this beautiful beautiful cardigan which three quarter length sort of bow sleeve but it's a maxi one i just think it's going to look so cute together and if it doesn't then i'm actually going to cry this is the three piece um why are all of the trousers see-through like what what is going on with this and why is this like popping open i've got small boobs i wouldn't mind um the cardigan's lovely though it's a beautiful cardigan i just don't really understand what's going on here like why what, just what please explain to me brands what is going on why is all of your material see-through it's not cool bro it's not cool um i'm gonna keep it because I like the look of it to lounge around in my own house with. But, I mean, I don't really think if you're going out anywhere, don't wear it. And if you're going to a mate's house, all your boyfriends don't, don't wear it. You can see everything. But, it's a nice colour. And for the price, it was okay. The only thing I would say is, why is it all like... my? Do you know what I mean? Like, some people's top half are bigger or smaller than their bottom half. And you can only either buy it in like an eight, so all of it's an eight. Which to me just doesn't seem right. Like you need to, you know, have different sizes for the tops as you can with the bottoms and stuff like that. People want things to fit differently, do you know what I mean? But other than that, I think it's okay. Another two piece. This one's really nice actually, it's taupe. And this is the cardigan, it's got the little buttons, it's cropped. What we like to see obviously cuffed sleeve got the elasticated waist on the bottoms just wide leg again how i like it i think that's quite cute it's heavy because it's knitted but i think it's quite nice this outfit is quite cute it's not see-through it's quite thick quite warm very nice and knitted cardigan cutest thing ever i think it's quite nice you could even you could wear this open to be honest with a little bralette underneath it and it would look quite nice the trousers are very long though and they're like really big they're like massive but like if i roll them over like i normally would do they just they fit really weirdly here <laughs> so i think i might just have to take the elastic in a bit but that's that's not really much to write home about this but not least pretty little thing i do love a cheeky i do love a cheeky pretty little thing haul i'm not gonna lie if you couldn't tell already i'm a love of a pretty little thing first thing that i brought was this cute little tote crop top which i just love these top i have so many of these like in different colors from pretty little things because they're just so easy to throw on with joggers or a skirt or just literally anything i also brought the mini uh, the matching maxi skirt with it obviously elasticated top so i think this will look quite nice in summer i love this this is going to be such a cute outfit in the summer the top is gorgeous i quite like the shade of brown it is quite nice camel stone color the maxi dress pants are a little bit see-through but i feel like if you wear some nude ones you'll be okay um it's got a little pocket down the side if you can see that on my leg it's sort of middle of your calf that comes down to i can't really show you because if i got this gorgeous gorgeous like puffer jacket but it's cropped and it's pale like baby pink Oh, it says colour may run. That's always good, isn't it? That's always good. The only reason I really brought this was because I wanted, like, a puffer jacket to put over my gym stuff when I go to the gym and stuff like that. So, this was my coat I brought for it. It's quite cute. It's got the little elasticated bottom. It's got buttons and a zip. And it's got a collar. I always love a good collar. I actually love this bomber jacket. This puffer coat crop bomber jacket, whatever you call them nowadays. I really like it. I only really got this to go to the gym in, but I like the waistband. I like how puffy it is. I like the cropped. I like the pale pink. I like the collar. It's really comfortable. I love it. I then brought some blazers because what's not to love about a blazer? This has got shoulder padding as well, which obviously Maisie loves. So got the shoulder pads. It's camel. It's got a very nice plunge. Um, it's meant to be oversized. 
So I did get it in a six instead of an eight. Because I'm a little bit undecided about what I would wear with this, but I probably would wear like a turtleneck just because it looks quite cute. I like this. I like the colour. I feel like it's very out there, but also quite subtle as well. I like the length because it goes just, just, you know, mid thigh. It's quite thin, but quite thick at the same time. Like you can layer under this, which I quite like. But at the same time, you could just get away wearing a bralette under this and still rock it in summer, which I think is quite cute. Got a black one. It's a sweater one, so it's really thick, but I feel like it's different. To be honest, this is like how I would probably style this blazer anyway. It's got some beautiful pockets. I sort of like the shoulder padding, everything about this. I really like this blazer. It's a big thumbs up for me. I think it looks pretty. And last but not least, I got another beautiful, like, fur, fake fur coat. I live in my black one. I quite literally live in my black one. So I thought I'd get, like, a cr creamy white one just to top it off. And it has a belt. This one has a belt with it, which is quite cute. It's really long. It's really comfy. It's just... I just quite like it. It's really soft. And that was a really good price in the sale, so of course I copped it. This coat is beautiful. I've always wanted like a white fur coat. It's really long, it's practically down to my ankles. But I like it. It's really warm. It's really thick. What's not to like about it? Plus it has a little belt, so... It does look a bit like a dressing gown, but... You know, fashion and all. I hope that you've enjoyed today's video. If you have, make sure you smash the thumbs up button. Comment down below any other videos you want to see me do on this channel. Subscribe if you haven't already. You can follow all my social media on the end screen. And I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.